Alhamdulillah wa salatu wa salam ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'd ahabta fillah from the uh, prophetic dua or supplications that are a part of the fortification for the Muslim is that they should supplicate or make a specific dua when entering the masjid. And this dua is recommended that when a person enters the masjid to pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, to exhibit ikhlas lillah, that they should say, O oh Allah, open the doors of your mercy for me. Allahumma iftali abwaab rahmatik. And when they leave, say, O oh Allah, I ask of you of your favors. Allahumma inna as'alakum min fadlik. Do to what Imam Muslim, rahmatullah alayhi rahmatin wasi'ah, reported from Abu Humaid, radiallahu ta'ala'an, Abu Usayyid, radiallahu ta'ala'an, who said that the Messenger of Allah, sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam, said, if one of you enters the mosque, they should say, Oh Allah, open the doors of your mercy for me. Allahumma ifta li abwaab rahmatika. And if they leave, they should say, Oh Allah, I ask you your favors. Allahumma inni as'alakum in fadlik. The secret in mentioning mercy while entering and favor while exiting is that one entering becomes busied with what brings him near to his reward and paradise. Meaning that when you enter the masjid, you're seeking the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you're seeking the reward and favor, you're going to busy yourself bi'idnillah ta'ala with that which draws you nearer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala with the remembrance of Allah. That is why you're going to the masjid. You're going to the masjid to pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, to remember him, to make the ultimate dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and be in the houses of dhikr. So at that point, you are in need of the mercy. So you are entering, asking for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's favor and mercy, that he accepts your dhikr, and that he is merciful to you, and that he blesses you, and accept and opens the doors of mercy for you. And the munasib of leaving the masjid and making the dua, when you're asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for his bounty or his favors, is because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says fi kitab al kareem disperse within the land and seek from the bounty of Allah. And At-Tibi rahimahullah ta'ala mentioned, he said, Haywa ibn Shuraih radiallahu ta'ala anhu said, I met Uqba ibn Muslim and said to him, I've been informed that you reported from Abdullah ibn Amr ibn al-As that the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi Wasallam used to say when entering the mosque, I seek refuge in Allah the Great in His noble countenance and in His eternal kingship from the accursed shaitan. He said, is this all that has been narrated to you? I said, yes. He said, if the person says that shaitan says they have been protected from me for the rest of the day. So it shows us, Abu Tafillah, that we should often supplicate to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and know the dhikr, the way of remembering Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala even when entering the masjid, that we should seek Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's mercy. And upon leaving, we should seek Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's bounties. And because we're seeking his rizq, his favors, his ni'am, when we leave the masjid, that is the time appropriate for asking for his fadl, for his fadl, for his bounties. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, uh, for his bounties and his favors and his mercy and his grace. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah la ilaha illa an subhanaka inni kuntum min al-zalimin wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.